Hello my adventurers, I'm CMG and welcome to Minecraft. Today, I'm going to show you guys how to install mods in Minecraft for 2020 and beyond. So, let's hop right into this video. To start off with, what we're going to do is I have some links to the pages that you need to go to in the description. So go check those out right now, like have them up in some uh, separate tabs, like how I do on screen right now. And what you're going to want to do is the mods in the description are what I'm going to be showing off throughout this tutorial if you guys want to also install the Minecraft Shrink mod. So, head on over to the first page, which should be the Chisel Me mod. So what you're going to want to do on that page, scroll all the way down on the page, and there's going to be Download from Server 1 or Download from Server 2 right at the very bottom. You're going to want to click one of those. That's going to open up a separate tab. Do not click the green buttons that say download. Those are advertisements. You don't want those. So click on the ones that say download from server 1 or 2. Try um, either one of those because this is a trustworthy site and I've downloaded all of my mods from these pages. I trust this. Once you've clicked that, the page up should be the one on screen as well that says download. It shows you the file size, the name of the file, and everything. So. After you cl click the download that's right in the middle of the screen right there, and it should download a file. It says the file may be harmful. Now, you don't have to install them at all whatsoever. I am not forcing you, but they are 100% trustworthy. I downloaded them from this site. Unless they've changed something, they are 100% safe. It's going to say that for every mod. After you download that mod, you're going to head on over to Forge, and whatever version mod that was, download that version of Forge. That link is also in the description below. So, while you're on Forge, as you see on screen, it shows you all of the different versions of Minecraft. So, the Shrink mod is version 1.10.2, so head on over Click version 1.10.2 and install the launcher for whether you have Windows, Mac, or I think Linux is on that list. For me, I'm on Windows. So I'm going to click Windows and install it. What you're going to want to do is you're going to want to put this file like maybe on your desktop or create a folder for your phone. Forge uh, installers because you might have a couple in case you want several different mods All right, make sure you have it downloaded and in a folder somewhere where you know you can go back and access it easily After that for Windows, I'm not really sure for Mac actually I'm gonna show it on screen right now on the mod page It shows you how to install forge as well. So I'm gonna show that little snippet right there and for Windows users though, in the bottom left corner, if you're on Windows 10, it says type here to search. What you're going to do is you're going to type run, R-U-N. And after you push run and push enter, there's going to be a little bar that appears to search up something. Type in that search bar, percent, so shift 5, app, data, all one word, percent and then push enter it'll show you all the app data for a bunch of different apps the folder that you are interested in for this mod download is going to be dot minecraft which should be self-explanatory but after you open it you're going to see a whole bunch of folders such as resource packs texture packs everything like that under the sun but there is no mods folder there. So if you haven't installed mods before, what you're going to do is you're going to right click on your mouse and create a new folder, all lowercase, mods, M-O-D-S. Now, after you have done that, open up the folder and 
type in the version of Minecraft that that mod is. For example, like we're doing 1.10.2. So you're going to create a folder in your mods folder and title it 1 point or period 10 period 2. So 1.10.2 is what you're going to create. And if you're going to do this for other mods, just do it that exact same way. So that way it knows to access that specific file. Now, after that file is created, go into your downloads, like on Google or wherever you downloaded the mod fo files. You're going to take those mods and drag them into the 1.10.2 folder. So that way you... So that way the game has access to those files and can run the mods. Next, what you're going to want to do is after you have all the mods in the folders that you want, go and find the Forge folder that you put the Forge mod installer in and run the software. You might have to run it as an administrator, so if you're not the one in charge of your computer, Ask your parents or whoever is in charge of it to uh, give you the password so that way you can install it. After you've done that and you've run it as administrator, you're going to want to click install. So you're going to want to install it into Minecraft. And after you install it, it'll take a little bit to install, but it's just going to load. Then it's going to give you a message saying that it has successfully been installed. Now, if you have another mod version running already in the Minecraft installer, it's not going to work unless you uninstall that uh, specific version in the Minecraft launch software. So you can't have Minecraft 1.7.2, let's just say, and 1.10.2 uh, launchers installed because they're both Forge installers. So you can only have one. After that, you're going to want to launch up your minecraft well launcher <laughs> and be able to click on versions and then your mod version right there 1.10.2 should be there and that basically concludes it for this video this is just a little video to show you how to create mods well download mods in minecraft now i respond to every comment on my videos and take everyone to heart so if you have any questions any questions for me or on how to install mods please let me know in the comments below and i will be on it as soon as possible i read them almost instantly because i get notified on my phone if someone commented so if you guys have any questions at all, any questions on how to install these mods, please let me know. I am here to help you. I am your customer support. So need help, need instructions, need guidance, go ask me a question. But if you guys just basically don't overly know or you're confused by some of the steps in these videos, there are other mod videos on YouTube. Mine is not the greatest one. There are YouTubers who have bigger channels who have been doing this longer than me, who are more experienced in downloading mods than I am. So go check out those mod videos. Just type in how to install mods in Minecraft. And if this video did help you, please leave a like and let me know what I could improve on in another video. <sighs> it, this, this has been an experience. Thank you for taking the time out of your day to check out my little mod video and learn how to install mods in Minecraft. Thank you all. Just thank you all so much for watching this video. Every single one of you are amazing and important. Thank you all so much for watching. And I hope all of you have a wonderful day.